The Food Engineering Club at Washington State University presents Microwave Ovens. Is there a risk of cancer? There are numerous stories on the internet that make many claims without scientific proof. They claim microwave ovens pose serious risk to human health, from cancer to lowered IQ to heart disease to fatigue. In this video, we will share the real science and look for the truths behind these myths. Let's consider the two most frequently asked questions and concerns. One, can standing near a microwave oven give me cancer? And two, can eating microwave food give me cancer? One, can standing near a microwave oven give me cancer? First of all, your microwave oven would have to be leaking microwaves in order for you to be exposed to them from standing near a microwave oven. Regulatory authorities have set strict safety rules and regulations for the manufacturers to keep the leakage level to a super safe minimum. In other words, during the lifetime of a microwave oven, the maximum allowable microwave leakage at 2 inch distance would be very, very small. This amount of energy is 1,000 times lower than the energy released from a small LED light bulb used on your Christmas tree. The risk of exposure is a lot less the farther you are standing away from the microwave. The door is also designed with an interlock switch system, so the moment you open it, the microwave generator is shut off. If your microwave oven is in good condition and is used correctly, it is safe to use without significant microwave leakage. However, for the sake of answering this question, let's assume that your oven is leaking microwaves and you are exposed. Will this exposure cause cancer? There are two classes of electromagnetic waves depending on how much energy they have, ionizing and non-ionizing. Ionizing waves, like X-ray or UV radiations, can break molecules and create carcinogens above a certain level of exposure. But microwaves cannot, because they are not ionizing waves. That's correct, since microwaves are in the non-ionizing category, they do not have enough energy to interfere with cellular processes in human body. The amount of microwaves that has been deemed hazardous for human health is 150 milliwatt per square centimeter. A high level of exposure to microwaves, for example, 150 milliwatt per square centimeter for 100 minutes, could cause similar effects as sunburn or electrical burn due to heating of cellular tissues. Just relax. The amount of microwave can leak in its lifetime is 30 times smaller than this hazardous level. In other words, it is highly unlikely you will have any negative health effects from correctly using your home microwave. 2. Can eating microwave heated food cause cancer? In general, cooking some foods under certain conditions causes chemical reactions to occur and sometimes can produce substances that have been related to cancer called carcinogens. Even stovetop, deep fried or baking food in the oven may contain deadly carcinogens such as grilled or fried meat, burnt popcorn, smoked food. Some cancer-causing chemicals come from overcooking the food and using high temperatures. The key to not having carcinogens in your food is to not overheat it, whether you cook using an oven, grill, or microwave. Currently, there is no evidence of new carcinogens being formed in food cooked or heated using a microwave oven in your kitchen in properly cooked meal. So rest assured, it is highly unlikely that eating microwave heated or microwave processed foods will increase your risk of cancer. Remember, once again, Standing in front of your microwave oven is highly unlikely to increase your chances of developing cancer. As long as your microwave oven is in good condition and used correctly, it is safe to use. This means that you can indulge in a quickly made, delicious, healthy microwave heated meal without putting yourself, your family, friends, loved ones, or anyone for that matter at an additional risk of cancer. We hope you enjoyed this informational video on microwave ovens and food. For more detailed information on these topics and other microwave-related information, please visit our webpage. For more topics, check out our video series. Please share our video with your friends and family to help us raise awareness and debunk common myths about microwaves. Credits, Food Engineering Club at Washington State University, sponsored in part by the Graduate and Professional Student Association at Washington State University, supported in part by USDA AFRI Grant. Thank you.